Alright folks, welcome back. In this video, we're going to work on the EB behind the back crossover while jumping over the rope. We've done this before, we only did it as a static drill, meaning we weren't actually jumping over the rope. So let's just quickly review that one. Go over and grab your uh, handles. You're going to start with the side swing, double up, one, two, one, two on either side. And then we're going to pull that hand behind for a nice smooth pass, both right and left sides. Okay, from the back, looks like something like this. Right here, passing behind. Side swipe, pass the rope behind. Okay, so we get used to pushing the handle to either side. Okay, very good. So now in order to jump through the loop and jump over the rope, we need to make sure that instead of scooping the hand over, we scoop it underneath. So go back to that side pass where we're not jumping over the rope. One, two, three, four. Both hands are coming to the side. I've looped my one hand nice in a big rainbow arc to make sure the rope goes to the side, and then I pull it back. Again, we did this in an earlier video, so if you do need to review, go back through the catalog, and review that video before coming back to this one. Let's try it to the left this time. Right, left, right, pass behind, and pull through. Right, left, right, pass behind, and pull through. So now the only difference is, instead of rainbowing over, we're gonna loop underneath, which is gonna bring the rope around the body that we have to jump over now. So we're gonna do it with the make sure that we actually smack ourselves in the ankle, but not too hard, because it's gonna be pretty tender. So, try it. Right, left, right, left hand goes behind, and I'm scooping underneath. As you can see, this is where I jump over the rope. So instead of passing over to the side and pulling out, I'm gonna bring it around to my front and scoop through, which is where I would jump over the rope. So, let's just try one at a time. Right, left, right, left hand is going behind, scoop and pull. Okay, one more time. Right, left, right, over, scoop. And this is where I jump through and over the rope. Let's try it again at a little bit of speed. Okay, that's it. Right, left, right, pull through. Oh, see I didn't make that one. Let's try it again. Two, three, four, right, left, right, pull through, and under. There we go. One, two, three, four, through, and under. Okay, let's see what that looks like in the back. Here. One, two, three, four, right, left, right, pass through, and under. One, two, three, four, right, left, right, pass under. Again, one, two, three, four, right, left, right. Whoops. Let's finish on a good note, shall we? One, two, three, four, pass. And there we go. All right. So in order to get uh, proficient at this one, you need to be patient. Because you've got to bring the rope through and underneath, and then pull the rope out to the side so you clear it and you don't catch your feet or your ankles on it. So for this drill, we're going to do four bounce steps, four side swings, and one EB cross under the feet. And then as we get better at this, we're going to break down those four bounce steps to three, to two, and then one. And then we'll start doing just repeating EB crosses behind the back. Yes? Awesome. Got my timer set up. As per usual, we're going to work 30 seconds with 15 second breaks in between, four total sets for two minutes of jumping and a little bit of rest in between. As you get more proficient at this, you're going to add more total rounds in, but still making sure you take breaks in between to stretch, grab a sip of water, and catch your breath. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go. I'm ready. You're ready. We're all ready. Four bounce, four side swipe, one EB. Ready? Two, one, here we go. One, two, four, one, two, three, four, pass. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, pass. Three, four, one, two, three, four, pass. Three, four, one, two, three, four, pass. Four, two, three, four, pass. Two, four, one, two, three, four, pass. Three, four, one, Four, pass. Two, three, four. Four, pass. Woo. Come by the bell. Okay, so this time we're going to try it on the left side. So when we do our side swipes, we start right, left, right, pass on the left. Two, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four, pass. Good 
Gets you mixed up a little bit from side to side, but easy to practice. Now let's break it down to three bounce steps. Still working the four side swipes and the one pass underneath. Three, two, one, let's go. Three, one, two, three, pass. Two, three, pass. Two, three, pass. One, two, three, pass. Two, three, pass. All right. Okay guys, now we're gonna try going is right to left. Might be a little bit more advanced if you're not quite there yet, no problem. Practice what we did before, before leveling up to here. Round four of four. Ready? Two, one, here we go. Bounce it. Pass it right. Left. 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 Keep going. One step. All right. Woo. Well done, guys. Again, not the most easiest of all the skills that you're going to learn, but it's really good for opening up your internal and external rotation flexibility in your shoulders. Great for building up accuracy and precision as well. And also, it looks pretty cool too. <laughs> so keep practicing guys, do not get frustrated. Eventually over time, you will definitely master these skills. Just keep at it and you will be successful. Until the next video, I'll see you then.